In this video, we're going to be looking at using the inverse norm function. So we've got uh, a normal distribution with a mean of 50 and a variance of 8. Uh, if the probability of x being less than a is 0 0.3, what is the value of a? That is what I want to calculate here. OK, so I've been given the probability I need to work backwards. So you go to menu and then you scroll down to number seven. And we want inverse normal, number three. Now, the area that it uses on the calculator is always to the left. So in this case, it's always useful to draw a diagram with any normal distribution problem. But the idea here is that to the left of A is 0.3. So the area that you are typing in is 0.3. So we type that in, 0.3. The sigma here is the square root of 8 standard deviation and the mean is 50 press equals and so a is 48.5 to three significant figures okay so just to kind of confirm that just to kind of show you can confirm that if you're not sure go to number seven on your calculator and go to normal cd and we can type in the lower value as minus a large number and we're going up to 48.5 sigma here is the square root of 8 it should retain that information and the mean is 50 okay as it's retained it press equals now what we're looking for is something close to 0 0.3 okay and so that shows that we're getting the correct value here okay so let's go back oh let's go back to menu one. Uh, now, for the second uh, example, probability of x being greater than b is 0 0.45. So again, draw a diagram. And to the right of b is 0 0.45. That's what that's saying. Now, remember, your calculator only works to the left with its areas. So we need to look at 0 0.55. So go to menu, number 7 inverse normal area is 0 0.55 sigma is the square root of 8 and the mean is 50 press equals and we get b is 50.4 to three significant figures and once again we can check that if we go to menu number seven normal cd and we're going to put the lower value in as 50.4, the upper value as a nice large number. Everything else is OK. Yeah, press equals and we get the 0 0.4437, which is close to the 0 0.45 as expected. 